More than 7 million people in the United States and nearly 22,000 Montanans have Alzheimer's disease, according to the Alzheimer's Association. The Alzheimer's Association works closely with caregivers and families, providing programs and resources like support and a 24-7 helpline with trained professionals ready to assist with emotional support and crisis care. They also train first responders to de-escalate situations involving Alzheimer's and dementia patients, whether it's wandering or abuse and neglect. Melanie Williams with the Alzheimer's Association says having local law enforcement trained on how to help dementia and Alzheimer's patients in a safe way is vital to the person diagnosed. So really focusing on how can we de-escalate those um, situations that they're not so traumatic for the person living with it. Um, they seem to have their emotional IQ, I call it emotional EQ, um, isn't as developed as it used to be. And so handling strange and different situations is definitely more difficult for them as they progress in the disease. The training walks through simple things like talking tactics. So that means talking slowly and keeping eye contact. To learn more, check out this story on our website, ktvh.com.